Okay, this is the Spofford house, Spofford house. Um, this house is breathtaking, uh, completely restored. Uh, I haven't seen anything like this in a long time, if maybe never. So um, a lot of this, a lot of the material in this home has been uh, refurbished. And um, when I say refurbished, I mean like removed, re stripped, and then redone. And uh, <laughs> I'm just like, what? So the sellers are here in the home. I'm not gonna get them on video, but um, it's a two story. And um, we're gonna take a look. Okay, so we do have a little child that, that is like right below the picture, the frame uh, of the video. So these are original that have been removed, stripped, milled, milled down, planed down, and then um, refinished. They've got original hardware on most of the house, starting with the knob. So we come into uh, kind of a foyer area. On the right side, <clears throat> we've got the master bedroom. These are original pine floors. Baseboards have been removed. Redone. So this was two rooms with a wall here that was opened up. So now it's the master with sliding closet doors. Original five panel door. And they match the doors, these doors. They removed um, those panels or those uh, that shiplap from the ceiling, stripped them down, refinished them, and then reinstalled them. These are from IKEA. Big shower. Give you an idea how big the shower is. My foot is 12 inches. So then we're going to go um, to the back of the house. We're starting our way from the back and work our way forward. So we kind of So once we step in, we've got a utility room here. Oops, water softener. bath Q 
cute little sink. Not real big. Big enough for the space. So we have a butcher block countertops that are from are the original part of the home. So these homes are reclaimed. This, these two buys were reclaimed, and then they used them to build the countertops. Got the beadboard up on top. So when the home was being um, rehabbed, he did go through the historical uh, commission here at HDRC. so that they were aware. They gave them the green light on everything that they did, or at least everything that they that they needed to do. So they didn't just kind of go and do their own thing. You said reverse osmosis, correct? Yeah. So we've got a reverse osmosis here in the kitchen. Lazy Susan, one and two. Yeah, that's okay. That's okay. And so all his data is right here. All his data lines here. So this was, is this is also part from the house too, right? Yeah, yeah, it's all wood from the house. Yeah, that's all Pre-wired, and then it runs back over here. So this is where your entertainment center would be. Let me see here. It's kind of. So before we go outside, we'll take a look upstairs. So he's got kind of a rubber rubbery texture on here so that you don't trip and fall. Extra storage, half kitchen. The Pearl is right there. Downtown is right over there. You can't see it because it's kind of a cloudy day. <clears throat> So there's three of these storages. Um, 
throughout the house like this. Spray foam insulation in the attic and then also on the southwest walls of the home. These doors look new. Yeah, these aren't these are just kind of built in. These are new doors. So he did all this himself, the homeowner. He bought it as an investment property and just and then decided just to move in while he finished it out. So all of this trim and all this woodwork he did on his own. Which is pretty admirable. Bedroom number three. Big closet. So you could put another wall right here if you wanted to make another room. Bathroom number two and a half. This is an amazing home. <clears throat> so let's go look outside. Fort Sam Houston is literally like two houses down the gate. I mean, the fence is like right here to the post. We'll go and take a look. Nice carport, two carports. Put your car over here, put your car over here. That way you don't get behind each other. Okay, so now we're in the front of the house. <clears throat> There's Fort Sam Houston right there, like literally. That fence right there, though, that building right there is Fort Sam Houston. So the gate, you go this way, take a right, and then there's a gate right here on your Braunfels. This house right here, uh, it's probably the worst thing about the house. It's not too bad, but um, It certainly doesn't like match, right? The rest of the other houses around here. This looks like it's probably some type of housing or something, duplex, quadplex right here. So uh, this is it. Street looks new. Sidewalk's good. Fence is good. Total green light on this one.